This show is sponsored by Green Chef. Green Chef is the number one meal kit for eating well. Go to greenchef.com slash poundcast60 and use the code word poundcast60 to get 60% off plus free shipping. That's greenchef.com slash poundcast60 and use code poundcast60 to get 60% off plus free shipping. Wow. You know what else? Huh? LVJCo.com is. Can I get a camera on this? Is where you can, is a good site you can check out. Yeah, LVJCo.com is one of our other sponsors today. Look at here. This is a couple bags of it right now. I'm going to bust it open. Oh right my now. gosh. Look at this live on camera. LVJCo.com is where you can get this. Legal vegan jerky. I haven't tried jer Jamaican jerk yet, but I'm really want, want to. Bite? Nah, I, didn't I don't touch want to. I would need to. Well, okay, fine, fine. No, I don't want to. No, uh, I, I'm, if I wasn't such a germ freak, then I would. Um, I wouldn't. I would be down right now. But uh, right. is that a good flavor? <laughs> I bet it's good. Flavor, I bet that's good. My mm. current flavor that I currently my favorite, and I haven't tried that yet. The jerk yet is that um, honey barbecue. Mm. That's good. The honey barbecue. Mm, that's a good one. And you know what? I shouldn't be eating during this ad, but cherry chipotle is good too. By the if way, if you get. As is the cowboy honey, steak. If you get the honey barbecue, which is made with agave, it uh, a portion of your purchase will go to benefit the factory in Louisville where Louisville Vegan Jerky is made, Shelby Park. They're going to give a portion of the sales up to ten grand to help their neighborhood. Um, and also, we also they also are offering the podcast listeners. A crazy discount, 30% off. If you go to lvjco.com, load up your cart, use the code word podcast 30. You still have time. You still have time. They're extending this deal throughout January, and you're going to get 30% off your entire order. And look, this stuff is made in the USA. It's bagged in the United States. It's also made... In Louisville, we went to the dang factory. This stuff is cruelty-free, plant-based jerky. And now that I open it, I can't, well, I can't stop. I, I can't. I will. I no, can't actually, stop. I have to say that it is not cruelty-free because I feel a bit of cruelty in that I, I, that you can't I, I want to eat it right now, but I can't eat it right now because I. I because of my own ish, my Brent, own. Brent, I'll give you this issues. bag of man, man. I don't even want to open. Sweet I don't. Chili I don't have any. I need to. Wa my hands home. are not. Oh, I have a bag. Hmm. This is good stuff. I'm really looking forward I to the jerk. I didn't think I would like the the Jamaican jerk. See, I think I will like maybe the jerk. Maybe. I love the jerk. Why is it kind of because you thought it'd be too spicy or something? I just didn't think I liked that kind of flavor, but they they nailed it. Hmm. Well, this is something different. Look, I'll tell you. And by the way, if you if you're listening to this after uh, January is over, you can still use the code word Poundcast and get twenty percent off. Okay. Yeah. So that's pretty cool. And also, you know, the stuff is available at other at stores and stuff. But I think order online, you get the discount. That's yeah. what I say. But it's, yeah. it's available. You can get the discount. You can get it at Sprouts and Sprouts and Whole Foods Whole and other foods. wherever they sell great foods. You, that's yeah. where you're gonna find it. But um, lvjco.com. Use the code word Poundcast. Code word Poundcast twenty. No, Poundcast thirty. Poundcast thirty for thirty percent off, or just Poundcast if you or want. Poundcast for twenty percent. You just off. only want twenty. <laughs> he's just Poundcast. You got it. And and uh, yeah, I mean, just check out all the new flavors they've got. You know, going mm -hmm. in there, it's, it's, it's really fun. LVJCo.com. That's when I say co. That's C O. Unbelievable stuff. It's spicy. Now my mouth is a little spicy. Oh, you spiced up. You might not like it. Maybe it's too spicy for you. Is that right? I don't know. I've got to. I've got to. I'm. In, I'm interested mm. though. Okay. Cowboy steak is kind of spicy too, by the way. Okay, look. Today okay. we got Reggie Watts on the show, and we just had a blast with him. He just came in and we just started like. We just joked around. Whenever we see him at a show, we just joke around, and he's like one of those guys that's like just. He's down to clown. He's just a fountain of joy and a fountain of fun conversation and a fountain and of talent too. And a fountain of talent. Clearly, he does. We do. He does different accents. You know, I kind of put him on the spot a little bit to do some different accents, and it's fun. We also hung out with him on the bonus 
um, unzipped episode. And if you want to listen to that and all the other bonus unzipped episodes, you got to go to patreon.com slash poundcast and subscribe to our Patreon. And that's, that's our real bread and butter. Our show is really sponsored by you, our listeners and viewers. Right, Brent? Need to. Need to go there. Pound <laughs> Patreon.com slash Patreon.com slash Poundcast. And I have one little quick announcement. Um, I think we're me and Mikey are gonna do a two at cruise show on March seventh at the Dynasty Typewriter in LA. So we're gonna have to we're gonna make a new short. We're Brent, gonna debut it there. Brent Weinbach's gonna be on the lineup. Well, no, I'm just kidding. I would love to put I'm, you. I'm up. just kidding. You're gonna be there. One, we're gonna put you on. Some, I'll be. I'll be there. Regardless. You're gonna be involved one way or the other. I'll be there regardless. You're gonna be in the video. You're gonna be at the maybe do a pun contest. You're gonna, oh yeah, pun contest definitely. In, I'll definitely be in the. You're gonna be yeah. up there somehow. I'll be up in the piece. You, you might want to check. You'll be that up in that out. piece. And by the way, you said our viewers. You know, at one point, I our did. listeners and viewers. And what he means by that is that we also you can watch this show um, on YouTube. YouTube.com slash The Poundcast. Um, there's also some highlight clips. And oh boy, you're going to love this next one. I think it should be up by the time this episode comes out. Um, the Animation? Yeah. The, Ryan Deacon, uh, whose YouTube channel is Glitch Time Fail. And it's also his Instagram account, Glitch Time Fail, uh, animated a, um, a, cl- a clip, uh, animated a, a segment from one of our. Uh, after Dark episodes, which was what Unzip used to be called, where we were talking about modern art, and it's a, it's really cool. It's a really cool. It's great. I love it. It's great. And uh, he, he just the, he animated this whole thing, and it's it's really cool. And that should be up on the YouTube channel. That that uh, that clip. It's also I think we'll post it on the Instagram as well if it's not already posted. All right, <clears throat> I'm spiced. I got to admit. So let's get on with the show. And we'll okay. Bring on Reggie, huh? I think that sounds... Oh, uh, the Instagram is The Poundcast, and so is Twitter, yeah. Yeah, check out... Oh, and TikTok is The Poundcast as well. And TikTok. Yeah. So, yeah, let's do that. Let's get get started. Let's roll the clip. Okay. Doug and Brad... Talking to each other, Doug and Brent. What will they talk about to Doug and Brent? Are talking to some pimples, Doug and Brent. We'll talk to their friends and Doug and Brent talking on the Poundcast. Oh, I see it's you guys. Yeah. <laughs> Welcome to the Poundcast. Thank you. We have uh, Reggie Watts here, and he's enjoying some nuts and Louisville vegan jerky because he needed a snack. I said, you need a snack. I got a snack for you, right there. And the li- liquid death, of course. <laughs> <laughs> what is that? We don't know what brand that is. These is nuts. These is nuts? Oh, these, oh those is nuts? These is nuts. Those nuts. These nuts. <laughs> um, what if somebody responded to these nuts like that? You know, they go, you know, hey, did he get you or whatever? And it's like, oh, who? And they, these nuts. And then the person responded with, oh, those nuts? That that is the proper response, and no one has done that. Yeah, that's the new level. Yeah, I know. That's, that's why it still next. exists in the it, like it, it's uh, something will exist in the popular vernacular until it's answered. Then it's done. <laughs> but no one's done it. Or someone can simply even just respond with they go, okay, do say D's nuts to me. Okay, uh, just like in any just yeah, just yeah, that. Okay, yeah. D's nuts. Those nuts. <laughs> you know they go in on it with them. You know what I mean. <laughs> Well, it's like, it's almost as if they're they're in on the joke, you know oh, what I mean? Oh, so I the guy goes like... He goes, oh, so you, they can't say that. Well, no, they can't hear like... You, they can't it, burn you with it. Well, say, you, you say you're trying to burn me with these right. nuts, okay? You go, uh, say, hey, did, did what's his name get at you yesterday or whatever? Say that. And then you say... These uh, nuts? And I'll say, who? These nuts who, gave D. Me. And I say, what do you mean, who, who? And then you go, these nuts, go like that. Uh-huh. And uh-huh. watch, just do these nuts oh, in shit. that way. Oh, shit. Go to ahead. you? Yeah. <laughs> These nuts. Those nuts. <laughs> you know what I mean? Well, now you've just killed it. It's done now. So now you can't you say D's nuts. I think I'm going to start doing it hard, a lot. Okay. It's going to be the new thing. How about D. Snyder's nuts? Oh, you my have, God. Like, nice nuts. His, I made that joke on, on a morning nice TV nuts. show once. I said, you know what the D stands for in D. Snyder? 
And, and they they said no, and I said D's nuts. I said, <laughs> what did they? What, how did they respond? Well, it was the one, there was the two hosts of the morning show, and the guy Regis was laughing a lot actually. <laughs> what? Yeah, Regis and Regis Kathy. And Kathy. Lee, it was it was a local show that was kind of in that vein, you know. And then the guy was laughing a lot at it, you know. I don't. Th- I think it went over the woman's head, but you know. oh, really? Yeah. Well, it's too early. <laughs> right, right. If it was in the maybe an afternoon show, I think she could have yeah. maybe gone in on it. Maybe she would have said "Doze nuts." <laughs> Doze nuts. Doze nuts. That yeah. Cool. <laughs> then, she, but she didn't think it was funny. It's just like how she naturally. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Doze nuts. Oh. Yeah. Doze nuts. I see yeah. the way you speak. You say "d" instead of "the." Okay, so yeah. I'll say "doze nuts." <laughs> Doze. Wait, you you say "d's nuts" to me? Okay. If I say. Is, was the name get at you yesterday? No, you gotta say the D's nuts. I know you gotta say who, who, you know, who, who. D's nuts. Well, I <laughs> mean, people you? don't say it like that. They, they just do. Say, they just go D's nuts. No, they don't. They they set you up. Do they say D's nuts or D's? Nuts? They say D's. They do say D. D e e z, and they set you, you just, up. You could just because you know what? I don't even know what that's from. Is that a Beastie Boys thing or something? No, it's oh, it's yeah, it it, con- it stems. I mean, it became it popularized from Snoop Doggy Dog, oh. and his uh, record called Doggy Style. Okay. And there's a there's a call, phone call on there where he is calling a, a girl, and he goes, you know, hey, what's you, you know what are you doing? She's like, oh, nothing. I have to get my nails done or whatever. And he goes. Uh, so what did, what's his name get at you yesterday or something like that and she goes who and he goes these nuts or something like that that's how the I conversation see. goes I see and that's how you set it up and how you get people is you get them to question something and oh you know and then they and then you these, hit them with these, these nuts what? These yeah nuts? something like that yeah and so that's how that that works and now but I'm thinking you can get in on it if you get hit with a D's nuts, mm-hmm. you hit them with the doze nuts. Yeah, doze nuts. <laughs> and so thing. anyway, I'm just taking it to oh, the I got one. Level. I guess I got one last. I know we, we, the whole show isn't about this, but um, <laughs> uh, try it one more time. It could say, be. Say, say, <laughs> it could be. Um, okay, so it, does, what's his name say, get at you say yesterday? Say D's nuts. Yeah, yeah, say that. Did, 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 D, get, did, did D call you yesterday? Uh, D, who, what? <laughs> D's nuts. Which ones? <laughs> <laughs> D's. Oh, okay. Yeah, Wait, which ones? D's. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Cool. <laughs> yeah, that shuts it down. Oh, too. thanks for clar. Oh, thanks for clarifying. Oh, thanks for the clarification. Oh, thanks for the clarification. Thank I you for the was wondering who does nuts worse. I was wondering about. I was wondering who does about nuts worse. I was. I, <laughs> who does nuts worse? I was. Do- I was wondering who does what nuts worse. <laughs> <laughs> who does nuts worse? I don't know. It depends on who you ask. You know what I'm saying? Some people do pretty good. Some people bad. <laughs> Hit me with it. Your mom. Okay. Yeah. Uh, you you gonna go to that uh, show later? Your mom is gonna go to the oh, show. She is, mom. Hey, mom. <laughs> Brent said you're coming. Oh, you are. Oh, I got verification. <laughs> <laughs> what if it's so like? Thanks, sweet. For the, thanks for the verification, mom. You want to Facetime Brent? <laughs> Let me hit me with it, your mom. Actually. Oh shit. Good luck. Your mom's going to the grocery store. Oh no, I was like, the, okay, well, yeah. All right, hey, are you gonna? Can you, you pick something up at the store? Your mom is. Doors, doors, moms. D's moms. Doors moms? Or D's Doors moms? Wait, moms? Oh, no, it's like this. Go yeah, like D's, this. D's moms? <laughs> Go like this. D's moms, and then show your balls. Like, those are your moms. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's good. That's good, actually. That's good. That's good. Your mom is going to pick something up in the coach's jar. D's moms. <laughs> <laughs> D's moms. It shuts out any burn. Wow, that's really good. Shuts so you any That's how you top a your mom, is you go D's moms. <laughs> yeah. Yep. And then you top a D's nuts by going <laughs> Doze nuts. nuts. Yeah, we're fixing we're fixing so much. <laughs> we're fixing so yeah. many we're slams right now. So this is so good, actually. No one's ever going to be able to wow. lose. Wow, these, this is... These bullies out here are going to be have to write new slams. Right. What, slams. Are, what are some other slams, actually? <laughs> slams. <laughs> they're not called slams. <laughs> yeah, they're called slams. <laughs> <laughs> what are some other slams, They're just slammed on you. Shit, we got, <laughs> Your we got, mom, of, of course. I mean, dunked on you. They're dunks. Dunks, yeah. Or they're bags, you know. Yeah, yeah. No. Bags. I think dunks should be a name. I don't know what other sneakers. slams there are. Burns. Right, dunks. I got the new dunks. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Common burns. I got the new Reggie Watts dunks. Yeah, they're really dunkable. <laughs> <laughs> dunkables. Dunkables. Yeah. What are the What are the other slams? <laughs> the other ones. <laughs> yeah, look, common household burns. Oh my God! I went to like Advent Health. I knew it. Of course, it was. Oh, like, that is really first degree, funny. Second That's degree. Fun. It's also funny. That household burns as if they only take place in the in the home. You know, like the the slams take place in the home only. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know? 
Yeah. You know, take out the trash. He's like, you're the trash, or I don't know, yeah, whatever. Yeah. No, no, that that, yeah. that 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 qualifies. Do the dishes. You're the dish. Yeah, yeah. Your you're mom's a, a dish. You're a dish. Yeah, you're you're a di- you're a dish <laughs> that I'd like to lick up. <laughs> yeah, that I'd like to eat up, you know, or something like, like you that. Say to your sister. Let's make some new ones. Now. <laughs> <laughs> you're you're well. Okay, so say it is household. Oh, how about, well, there's that's what she said. You know, there's that one, but that's not really a burn. It's just more of like. Mm. A conversation ender that's supposed to be funny. That's what she right, so. Right, right, that's right. That's what she right. so. That's not, yeah, it's not a slam. It's not really a slam. That is, that is what, that's <laughs> how slam. she responded. <laughs> oh, you know what's a slam? <laughs> Moated. Moated. Uh, like demoted? <laughs> Short for demoted? <laughs> Actually, I, yeah, I, I was thinking about a joke that was, um, you know, li- how l- people say, well, I was trying to create a slang word called JIT, which was short for legit. Oh, of course. Which yeah. is slang for legitimate, which is slang for illegitimate or short for illegitimate. Oh, okay. Wow. <laughs> All right. No. <laughs> that, that's, that's my joke. That was right, my that's joke. That's the joke because that's it's my not joke now. is that it's short for Ill- illegitimate. <laughs> legitimate is short for illegitimate. JIT. Okay. Mm. Um, Dude, that's it. Uh, okay, but uh, no, yeah, moated. Yeah, got. Oh, got you moated. What's that? What's How that? about pwned? Or, or even, oh, or even. Pwned. I told you so. That's told true. you so. That's a slam, sort of. Like, like I, like I always say. <laughs> that's one. Like oh. I always say. And like, <laughs> just like. Hey, I told like you a, so. Like I already said that. Yeah, I already like, said that. I already said that. What if you just said like, you did? You did? Told yeah, you so. you told you so. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you, you sure did. did. You sure did. You sure did, buddy. <laughs> yeah. You did tell me so. It's like, no, you didn't. You you told me, I don't know. I guess it depends on what they oh, said. Oh, what, what about Wait, this? Tell, tell me, told I got you so. One. Wait. Hey, Brent, uh, the speed limit is 25 on this street. I told you so. You you told you did tell you so he's he's cool he's that new exchange student yeah you <laughs> so I should go ask him about you so Latif <laughs> you hit me like with someone's it. called you told so. me you You're... told me so you know what I it act, I should have actually got the strawberry instead of vanilla I told you so your mom or yeah you, wait you did tell me so mom. <laughs> <laughs> or, I'm calling you mom now like you're my mom oh, that's yeah good. hey well I guess that's what moms are for. <laughs> it's, Something he like did that. Tell me so. so yeah, you know what? Yeah, mom. Yeah, mom. All right, all right. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. What is the line? What did you say? Yeah, I don't know. Did, you did tell me so. Is that what? Yeah, you, you yeah, you did. You did tell me so, mom. So, so, <laughs> so, so, how do you set that up again? How do you set that up? You just ask a quite like well, a question you, that they already <laughs> told you earlier. Okay. Like, you know. So so say so say say it to me. Say a question. Okay. Yeah. So you want me to say your mom to you eventually? Yeah. So so like you that, say yeah. to me. Oh, it turns out I. It turns out something. Oh, you, you were right about this, and or something like that. Oh, okay. Is that the question? Yeah, you say that to me. Oh, I say that. It's like, yeah, I t- or what? How do I just say? say like? It turns out the jerky oh, was. Turns really out good. the jerky was a great. I, I told you so. And and then oh, and then my comeback is yeah. oh yeah, fuck you, <laughs> mom, <laughs> mom. <laughs> I do what I want, mom. Maybe that's what it is too. You know, <laughs> you're not my. You know. You're not my mom. mom. You're not my mom. mom. You're not not my mom. How about that? You're not my mom. (laughs) Are you? All right. You're not my real mom. (laughs) You're not my real mom. You could be my mom. (laughs) How about this? Give me a "told you so" right now. I told you so. That was pretty good. He's. uh, I forgot actually how it goes. I I didn't remember. You're not my mom. Was it? You're not my mom anymore. Or you're not my. You're not my real mom. Oh, anymore. 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 That's anymore. An, maybe. That's an You're not my real mom anymore. Brent, um, birds do fly south for the winter. I told you so. Your mom's balls are Dee's balls. <laughs> Your mom. <yeah. laughs> Your mom's not my balls anymore. <laughs> Your mom's not my mom. Yeah. Oh, this is what I was going to say. That's I was going to say this. When that's, you say you told me healthy. so, I was going to say, whatever. You're not my real mom. You just go, good. whatever. You're not my real mom. You're my balls now. <laughs> <laughs> or something like that. Right? You're my balls, that's good. Mom. By the way, you guys were asking me earlier what this was. Yeah. Yeah. For the listeners, I have a bandage on my hand. He does. Yeah. Uh, here's really what good. happened. I was at CVS on the way in here. And... Um, I was at the self checkout, and this this teenage kid was behind me, and he was and it, like one my one thing was in, was in scanning. It's not my fault. I'm just going like, I'm like, you know, let's go here. I'm like flattening it out. I'm like the, the UPC thing. Yeah, it's yeah. not going. Yeah. He goes, hey man, don't you know how to use that thing? I goes, bashed him in the fucking face <laughs> with the backhand. I didn't even look at him. That makes sense. And he had braces on, so he cut my hey. hand. Oh my gosh. 
That sucks, man. Yeah. So he goes, but it's you hit him in the face, you went, these nuts. <laughs> and then he hits you, and then his braces hit your hand, and he goes, told you so. You said, and I made his teeth all back out of wax, so he had to go straight from the oh my God. straight from one back to one on the braces. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You should have said something like you should have gone. You should have gone with Invisalign, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> no, I okay. Here's a here's a true story. I got the colos, colonoscopy this morning. Yeah, hey, look, Col- think, Col- 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 what still have these? Whoa, they, why did they take they, these off? Take, they don't take those off. Whoa. I remember <laughs> I, I I I recently had got a lipoma removed. And uh, and yeah, I got got I, I got home. I'm just I, I got these home now, and like, I was like, "Why are these still on?" <laughs> they're like, they're like, it's too not, painful to you, rip off. You handle that yourself. Yeah, you, like, you we're do not that. doing that. We're not doing that. We're but only gonna stick of, a camera system up your butt. Yeah, but yeah, we're not gonna take off a little sticker. No, we're not gonna. We're not do gonna that. do that. We don't do that. We just yeah, that's not our thing. We don't do that for a long time. don't play that shit still. Still stuck, so I was like, I know I took like three showers, and I was like, man, my skin, I guess, just must be just crazy right now. And I was like, oh no, that's just the glue from this. Oh fucking my God. Oh, oh, oh. I thought it was that you were feeling that thing, that whole patch thing or whatever, and you're thinking, my skin feels so kind it of feel, like a card, it cardboard, or plastic or something, it's plasticky, it's, yeah, with a plastic-y. weird nub in the middle. Yeah, yeah. what is that? I, the, uh, I have a rash. The doctor that operated, that did the procedure, yeah, on my butt, yeah, Doctor Dong. No. Really? Straight up. Damn, that sucks. <laughs> Her name was Dr. Dong. Oh, Jesus. Oh, wow. She's like, hi, I'm Dr. Dong. And she's Damn. a young woman. She just you know? she just has to just glide over that real quick. Like, can't, she was kind of an attractive young woman. I'm like, does do you have to do the camera up my butt? Can it be like some, you know, some Carol O'Connor looking Carol guy? Con- <laughs> <laughs> Carol O'Connor. You know? And he has the same attitude as Archie Bunker, too. <laughs> yeah. He's just kind of a... All right, okay. roll over. Yeah, put spread them. Yeah, get it in the butt. Fucking <laughs> Ernest Borgnine. I want Ernest yeah. Borgnine doing Marty, this. you want Marty. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, but then she put on music. It was like I'm laying in the waiting area. It's all know? like smooth jazz. It's I'm all I'm laying sexual. in the waiting area, and then we go into the. They make it like comfortable for the uh, the patient. In the, I think they must do that for the patient. They're playing kind of like, like elevator music. It, no, it was like kind of like. Motown, it was like kind of like upbeat, kind of like uh-huh. nice music, you know. And uh, then they hit you with the propofol. Propofol? Is that what it's called? Propofol? <laughs> it's that Dr. Conrad Murray stuff. Oh, what is it? Is it like a, uh, is it, an, was it Pro- Pokemon? Pokemon. <laughs> propofol. <laughs> I, propofol. I think that's what it was. So It's the happy juice that makes you just kind of chill. Oh, yeah. gotcha. Like Xanax times a thousand. Yeah. Gotcha. So I'm still kind of coursing through my veins a little That's bit. That's sick. That's a good feeling. <laughs> it wasn't bad. It's such a good feeling to know you're alive. Yeah. You know? And, you and I was it. watching it on a flat screen. I was watching my colon. That's so, so what'd that weird. look like? No polyps. I came clean. I got a nice butt. What were you in for? Pol- possible polyps? They found a couple match... Box cars in there. <laughs> oh, that's cool. Yeah, that that's weird. They had to. Cl- that makes sense. Had a like grab the, the from the funny car series. <laughs> <laughs> I guess they'd been in there since I was five. Uh, yeah, I, yeah, that uh, makes never... sense. That does make sense. That's so cool, though. Did they remove them or they left them? They're like, do you want us to take these out? I'm like, no, they're kind of cool. I like this. <laughs> <laughs> I'm used to them. Do they race them in there? <laughs> they race them. <laughs> they're like, we'll take them out, but you got to. You gotta rinse them off. <laughs> yeah, it's like it's up to you to clean them, have them detailed. <laughs> what what, uh, what were you in for originally? I mean, why did why were you getting it done? Just After to, a certain age, you, you guys just, okay. guys gotta just do it mm-hmm. to detect colon cancer, which is a common cancer. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and uh, they said come back in ten years. You're good for ten years. Oh, ten years, really? That's good. Wow, that crazy. Damn, yo, that's. I good. went to a. a an anologist and uh, <laughs> and and he and it said that um all all he did was do like the finger thing that was it oh yeah, yeah. Uh, oh that's it, for the prostate I think yeah it was it. a prostate thing but like I don't know he just didn't really because I went in there because I wanted to like oh I should check that shit out or whatever <laughs> whatever he he did that thing and he was like oh it looks great I was like oh okay but I mean there's obviously there's deeper things in there. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe I should go for that. What if there was like a Nosferatu looking doctor with like super long fingers? That'd be cool. <laughs> he's like, I'd feel, I'd trust him. <laughs> he's got the teeth too. <laughs> yeah. The two, just two, two front teeth. That was like the weirdest yeah. looking vampire. Cause he, right. like, it's like a rabbit. Front teeth. <laughs> it's like a rabbit like a vampire. Beaver. Yeah. Like a rabbit, rabbit vampire. Do you remember those books called Bonicula? 
Yes, I do. He's Nosferatu is Banicula. He basically. is Banicula. Is the original Banicula? Yeah, yeah. Kind of like a, <laughs> kind of like a Yoda. And he doesn't say anything too, because the Nosferatu doesn't even say anything, right? No, he just he comes never in did. and he gets he goes for the butt. He just goes. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, 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 <laughs> unless you're unless you're watching what we do in the shadows, and that guy does talk. Oh, he does. Okay, yeah, yeah. yeah. They have a Nosferatu guy, but he does. Talk. Oh, I, I mean, maybe the original one did too. I mean, no, the one in the movie. Silent. Oh, yes, right. But it was silent. We it was silent, know. but I mean, there might have been titles for him, maybe. I think that famous scene where you see the shadow first going up the stairs. Mm -hmm. If if there was sound, you probably just hear like, <laughs> uh -huh. Uh -huh. like that kind. Of thing. Yeah, 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 yeah. Imagine what the Nosferatu talking. sounded like in the silent films. You know, I can't in the wait. silent film, that is. Yeah, <laughs> I can't wait. Oh, you did it. I mean, but oh. what what other possibilities? I'm thinking this. I think that's more accurate. He's got the teeth. Down. Well, that's the fine detail. <laughs> or maybe he sounds like this. Get, so, or like a, some kind of bunny or something, you know? Like a yeah. what's that? What's the name of the bunny that? Or it's a. It sounds like a chicken, right? The Cadbury bunny. It sounds like a chicken because it lays a chocolate oh. egg and stuff. Oh. Uh, yeah. Oh yeah, the bok bok. Yeah. What if um, Nosferatu had a chicken sound? That'd be kind of interesting. I. I mean, I. I could, I hope. <laughs> I hope. You can only hope. Actually, yeah. I, I really do. You hope. guys have all seen Nosferatu, right? I think I haven't. I think I saw it I, in like film school, maybe, no. but I don't really remember. I, I saw, just remember yeah, that one scene. Scenes of There's it. that scene, yeah. and then the, her into the bedroom, the bed, when he like comes into the bedroom. Is that even like a feature film, or is it like a? I think so it old is. That it's it like is. twenty minutes. No, no, long. it's feature. Know, it's a, it is feature. It is. It's okay. a feature length. I I saw it kind of recently, actually. Oh really? Yeah. How was it? Um, do you like it? It was cool. You know, it's cool. It's cool. cool. It's cool. Okay. Have you seen Nosferat One? Is the the prequel? <laughs> <laughs> Nosferat Three. <laughs> this time it's personal. <laughs> He's thirstier than ever. That's really funny. That's really <laughs> Nosferat. Longer fingers. Nos Nosferat One. Nosferat One. Nosferat Two. Nosferat Three. I saw the whole trilogy. The whole trilogy. Three's not as good the as second two. One's the yeah. Second one's the best. Second one's the best. Yeah, the most well known. Second one's the best. Three's not as good, but one is better than three. <laughs> yeah, for sure. Yeah, one is better than three, but that's, two's the best. That's three really sucks. funny. <laughs> no, I I had seen clips. I think in you know in film classes, you know, but or in or, a film class in school. But then I saw the full thing maybe a year or two ago. Well, didn't he come back out in Salem's Lot? <laughs> What's that? He was he was in Salem's Lot. Is that a movie? A vampire, yeah. <laughs> he came back. Yeah, it was he, the same vampire. Well, there was, of course, you know, Werner Herzog's Nosferatu. Um, it's Werner. Or, or, yeah, you know. <laughs> Werner. I'm just going to see Salem's Lot. Look it up. Salem's Lot. Vampire. Okay. I'm sorry I bring I brought that up. I just... Nosferatu? Okay. We're going on the Nosferatu tangent. Yeah, Salem's Lot. Same dude. Oh. Oh, just, yeah. Just, there he is. just updated. <laughs> updated. <laughs> Yeah, he's. <laughs> yeah, I like to see oh, yeah, Jim this... Carrey do no, like a comedy version of it. Okay. Yeah, those teeth. Those yeah. are some blood sucking teeth, though. Yeah, that that kind of is dope. Yeah. That is really terrifying, actually. But let's see. But then if we look at Nosferatu three, well, let's actually let's do Nosferatu <laughs> two, just just to, just because that's what people are used to. Because he changed his look. For... Uh huh. <laughs> Maybe Aaron should pull these up. Oh, he, are you pulling him out? Yeah, see, same guy. Hmm. They got the same guy both times. Yeah, he was yeah, available. Same guy. Yeah. And then if what we do in the shadows, what we do in the shadows, Nosferatu. <laughs> I think he's. I think we get the same guy again. I think it's the same actor. Yeah. The yeah, same guy, basically. <laughs> yeah, they so, stayed pretty faithful to the. Yeah. To the look of the character in all three of those. Yeah, well, it's the same actor. Oh, right, right. <laughs> no makeup either. Well, he did, he he can live that long because he's a vampire. Yeah, well, yeah, that's yeah. That's I mean, how they're obviously. able to. He works. He works. You know, he's been working since silent films. You know. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> yeah, probably even before. Yeah, before even. Yeah. He was he's, just straight working. He's he's always been working. He's always been working. He's a vampire. He can works. He can work forever. That's so cool. Well, until until he. You know, well, until they through the heart, right, right. Yeah, you gotta keep him away from. Or it falls into a bath of silver. He has that in his writer that no wooden stakes on set. You know, <laughs> that's true. Yeah, yeah. yeah. No, in case of any accidents or whatever. Yeah, it's like people have to wear a little wristband that just says no mistakes. On they have it. to go through wood detectors. <laughs> yeah, know? wood detectors. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> 
Totally. Get yeah. the pat down, yeah. The shape detector. <laughs> yeah. I think crazy so if it was a metal stake, he'd be fine. Yeah. Isn't that weird? That's weird. No one ever thinks about that. Isn't that weird? Isn't that weird? Like, yeah, you know, it you, is you could survive a metal stick. Yeah, yeah, totally. It's like, what? You may stop. It is metal. <laughs> Wood is what you are looking for. I, You know, I actually went to um, Dracula's castle in... Um, Vlad the Impaler? Vlad the Impaler's oh, yeah, Vlad the Impaler. class castle in Bran, which is in Romania. Oh, right. Which is in the... Uh, what did you think of it? Kind of near the provincial capital, uh, uh, Brazov. Yeah, that, in uh, Transylvania. It's in Transylvania. It's oh, a Trans- part of uh, of Romania. Romania. Yeah. Romania. Yeah. And uh, it looked like a nice kind of via, actually. You know, it was kind of. It wasn't a scary looking castle. You oh, know what okay. I mean? It looked like a, a nice spot. You know. I, I went to this really spooky dentist. Actually, speaking to doctors. <laughs> Whoa. Yeah. Um, they had the place all haunted looking. It's called Transylvania. Oh, Tonsylvania. Oh, Tonsylvania? Yeah. Okay, I'm looking that up. There you go. Oh, look. <laughs> He's got him pulled up. Oh, there's... <laughs> yeah, see? Oh, you Count Chocula. Count Chocula. Count Chocula. Count Chocula. You know what? You're right. But Count Chocula's got hair. Whoa. Though. That's the difference, because no. he's from the 70s. He does, but he's... But he's got those teeth. Though. I think it's a wig, does actually. Have, <laughs> I, think, I think Count Chocula is wearing a wig, but it's crazy that he has the two front teeth as the teeth. Yeah, but the... I think General Mills or whatever was like, look, kids don't like the bald. On We can't have a bald character on our cereal. Give him a wig. Give him a wig. <laughs> I do like the, the detail of the of Salem's Lot vampire of like his ears chipped, you know, like like a cat. Oh, you know, yeah, like yeah. Cats, like, he's like, his other one's fine, but that one's kind of chipped. Right. Maybe he got in like a that. fight. Maybe yeah. he got into a fight with Tyson. Yeah. <laughs> Vamp fight. Yeah, totally. Well, in part three, he'd think he fights Tyson, right? <laughs> Yeah. By the way, I had Tyson's frozen chicken. That's Rodzi sure. versus Tyson. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Not Mike Tyson. It's, no, no. Tyson, it's Tyson the, the chicken. Yeah, the, fr- the chip frozen chicken. <laughs> yeah. I had this uh, idea for um, the Annie, Annie Milanaka show in 2005. Yeah. I mean, I wrote a packet for them. Right. And th- it was um, Annie Milanaka is watching a horror movie, and um, it's a it's a vampire movie, and he and he goes into it, and there's or he has a dream that he goes into the TV and he opens the coffin and Mike Tyson is in there and it's Mike Tyson as a vampire. And then Mike Tyson bites him or something like that. And he wakes up from it as if it was a dream. And then he looks in the mirror and he has the same tattoo on his face uh-huh. as if that was a symbol of that he got bit. And so, but anyway, and then, I don't know, a month or a month and a half later, I, my friend says, hey, put it on Jimmy Kimmel Live because he helped me with the packet. And there was Mike Tyson as a, as a vampire, and Jonathan Kimmel was a, was a producer on was Jimmy Kimmel's brother was a producer on Annie Milanaka's show. What? Ah. They so, took your shit. Seemed like seemed like they did. Seemed yeah. like yeah. that's way too specific. <laughs> seemed like it. Yeah, because also that was in 2005 when nobody it, nobody was really. I mean, people already had done all their Mike Tyson biting jokes. You know what I mean? Because that <laughs> yeah. was 10 years prior. You yeah, know, yeah. or yeah. it was 95, 96 when Mike Tyson bit. And um, so all of a sudden, I I kind of made a joke about that, and then they're doing a joke about that kind of. as interesting timing. Was yeah. it the same gag where, like, he bites someone and then they no, get no, the no, tattoo? No, 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 not that. But just it was just him as a va- – he was dressed as a vampire. Uh, but Mike Tyson – it was actually Mike Tyson? It was Mike Tyson, and Whoa. he was on the show dressed as a vampire. Nobody had done that joke yet. Whoa. Even in the 10 years that since he had bitten somebody – Evander, you know, Evander, you know, and, uh, but, uh, I just thought it was interesting. I mean, it was Halloween when he was, it was, he was, it was Halloween, but I just thought the timing was just kind of weird because I just, anyway, it was interesting timing, you know, all I'm saying is, is Saturday Night Live aren't the only uh, people who benefit from, uh, yeah, you know, from stuff, from stuff. (laughs) Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Um, wait, do you still work on that show? Um, which one? Corbin. Cortman. Yeah, uh, yeah, Cor- 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 Courtney Love. Cor- Wait, what show do you Courtney. work on? Courtney. Uh, I work on the late, late show. With who? With James <laughs> Corden. James. Jan 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 Cordon. James Corden. Jan, young Corden. Jan, young Corden. Young Corden. Young Corden. Yeah, Young Corden. Um, cool. Commissioner Corden. I, 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 I hate to say a, I've never seen that show. Oh well, I'm glad that you haven't. I'm not up that late. I've, I've I'm an early bird. I. You know, I saw one episode. I saw the very first episode that we did. You've never serious? seen any other episode? You don't watch your show? You don't say, like, look what no, I did tonight. No, because I'm there. 
Oh, you know, you I'm, saw the show. Right? I was the, at the show, yeah. So I saw the show. Yeah. Um, no, I never see it. I see clips once in a while. Like if there's like a bit that we do or whatever, or that I'm involved in, then I'll look online. But yeah, I don't. I don't. I, I feel like I get it. <laughs> you know, or you got it. Is it, it, is it fun? Fun gig. Yeah, it, well, it's really super easy. But nowadays, like, we're coming to an end, and, and now I'm kind of feeling like, uh, like, like. Senioritis? Like, yeah. Like, like I'm, like, oh, a little over. How much more do you got to do? April 28th. Wow. Hey, what are you going to, what's your plan after that? Cordon blew it. Okay, Cordon <laughs> blew it. Yeah, he blew it. <laughs> Cordon, for the first time. Yeah. Um, yeah, you know, I have I have a bunch of shit I'm pitching, so uh, like five shows. So we'll see. Curveballs, th- you know, s- yeah, speed balls and speed balls, yeah, curves, <laughs> uh, knuckle balls. Yeah, yeah, right, right, right. yeah knuckle corkscrews. <laughs> a couple of corkscrews. Yeah, yeah, a couple of corkscrews. Yeah, a lot of pitches. You know, uh-huh. we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Probably none of them will go, just because you know. That's just Are things uh, they all? Kind of um, that's how they scripted how they kind of things, ideas, or uh, like that, you or? give us an elevator pitch, or are these NDA, Whoa. these top secret kind top of things. Secret. NDA is a pretty hardcore rap band. I, I <laughs> um, yeah, what would that band be? I, yeah, NDA. <laughs> uh, I don't, I don't know. <laughs> uh, um, D could stand for D's. No, well, it could, no, it could be like. Uh, <laughs> D's ass. Nick's uh, <laughs> dis. <sighs> it's tough. That's a it's tough. A tough that's one. a tough yeah. one because MWA just works so well. Um. Yeah. yeah. Uh, well. Okay. All it, uh, D's ass sounds good. You know. Or D's, D's, ass. A, D's asses. D's asses. D's asses. D's asses. But what is the end? Not stand D's for? asses. Yeah. Oh yeah. Not D's asses. Uh, yeah, not yeah. D's asses. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And maybe it should be like a super G-rated version. You yeah. Know, like. Yeah. Nice dudes and associates. <laughs> yeah, talking about the co- how the cops aren't that bad. <laughs> nice dudes always. Nice dudes always. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. It sounds like it sounds like every good boy does fine always. You know. Well, the, or yeah. whatever, however, how that goes. Yeah. Oh, you're you're not just saying that. Okay. No, you, you, no, 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 no. You know about that? Every good boy does fine always. I didn't. That's the scale. It's, oh, those right. are the line. Those are the line. The line notes on a, on a staff. Uh-huh. Oh really? Yeah. Every boy. Every good Tuesday. boy does fine always, or something like that. You know? Oh. And then face is the 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 ones that are not the line notes. You know, not not that for are, the not for the A team. <laughs> <laughs> no. no. Um, <laughs> let me tell you a little something about our sponsor, Green Chef. Oh, Green Chef. This is the meal kit service, right? Very good, Doug. Green Chef has meal kit options for every lifestyle. We're talking keto and paleo, vegan, vegetarian, fast and fit, Mediterranean, gluten-free. Now, I hear their recipes feature organic produce, premium proteins, and sustainably sourced ingredients. Is this true? It is. (laughs) (laughs) And they expanded their menu. You can now choose from 30 recipes weekly Whoa. with the option to mix and match meals from different dietary preferences in the same box without changing your plan. As you can guess, I will be getting the vegan meal kit, Brent. Mm-hmm. I usually cook like the same three things at home, but um, what I like about Green Chef is that they're going to send me meals and flavors that I, would, I wouldn't normally cook myself. Um, and it's easy. I, yeah, well, I, yeah, I mean, it's, I mean, I can't wait to get my meal kit because the thing is, I want to make a home cooked meal, Mm -hmm. but I also don't want to deal with the hassle of going to the store to get all the different ingredients and then having to deal with prepping all, all the ingredients and measuring things out and stuff. I like how much time this saves to have a good meal at home. You know, it's just, it's a nice in between where, it's not just ordering delivery. It's it's an in between between a full on making meals yourself and ordering delivery. It's a nice in between. Yeah, you said it. <laughs> <laughs> you said it. Yeah, yeah, I did. So go to greenchef.com slash poundcast sixty and use the code word poundcast sixty to get sixty percent off plus free shipping. Sixty percent off, friends. You know what? 
That's greenchef.com slash poundcast60 and use code poundcast60 to get 60% off free shipping, plus free shipping, that is, for Green Chef, the number one meal kit for eating well. Mm. I feel like Reggie's been interviewed about his this, everything, everything all the time. A yeah. times. So here's what I need to ask you. Okay. Ask me. About, ask me. About your K-hole. Ask you, me. You have a, a button that says, ask me about my K-hole. Yeah, ask me about my K-hole. Uh, well. Did you make that? No, it was given it at um, this really cool party called, um, well, I can't really say the name of the party, but it's a big party. It happens every year, and it's hotel takeover type of thing. Coachella. Kind of, <laughs> but in a hotella. Really? There's a hotel takeover party? Yeah, in, um, in Tahoe. Huh. Yeah, what they take over, it's like 2,000 people. It's like a festival, but it's in a hotel. But, oh. but it's all psychedelic space, so it's like tons of psychonauts, people like that. And this guy gave me this pen. I got a bunch of pens. I got a gr- grip of pens. I have another one that says try DMT. It's really nice. <laughs> it's cool. Um, that's where I got it. Have you been in a K-hole? I have. I have many. I'd say probably like four solid ones for sure. You, you don't have any problem taking a... A psychedelic? No. You're a trippy dude. No, I don't. I don't have a problem taking a psychedelic. <laughs> I don't. I don't. I mean, I love them. They're 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 fun. You know, they're you know. Sometimes I get a little scared before I take it, but then I do, and then it's fine. And the scares goes away. The scares goes away. But the ketamine is definitely the one that I've probably been more into the most lately, for sure. Just because it's. And when you get into that level, that higher level of k- k- ketamine, you're like, I, it just feels like, like it's impossible. Your body impossible. doesn't exist anymore. Or yeah, your like body that, doesn't right? exist, but it just feels like you're perceiving, like, their most fantastic thoughts that you've ever experienced. Like, your moments where you're like, whoa, the universe is incredible, like that kind of stuff or whatever. Uh-huh. Or like, whoa, magic is real. Or anything yeah. like where you're suspending your, your disbelief. It's like a million times more fantastic than that. It's It's like, it feels like... There's no way that you could be perceiving reality in this way. It's huh. insane. But well, when uh, it becomes over the counter, I'll check it out. Yeah, yeah, it'll probably in the next two years, <laughs> I would imagine, as lozenges point of pur- point of purchase. Probably Air One first, the pilot program. <laughs> Go, you know, Dude, no, don't drive is... on it, or you have to sign a thing. So I was like, I promise not to drive on it. I won't drive on, on it. Now, speaking of driving, uh oh, I checked out his car out front. It's got a pretty sweet. Oh, I think I saw it the other night. Yeah, yeah. but there's like yeah, cameras. It's a, it's in the a front. Co- Camry, right? It's a Toyota Camry. It's a Camry yeah. GT. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, it's a great. It's a great one. I love it. It's you got a, a Porsche. I got a Porsche. Yeah, nine nine two Turbo S. It was great. I drove it up today to Newcomb's Ranch. It's like a little meetup that they do every Friday uh, in the morning. Porsche meetup. Kind of. Is it like up in the canyons? Yeah. They, they take their cars and they zoom around? Not yet. Well, it's up in uh, Angeles Crest. Yeah. Uh, Angeles National yeah. Forest. There's a place up there that used to be open. It was a cafe called Newcomb's Ranch. It closed down during the lockdown. Sure. But everyone still meets up there in the parking lot. And yeah, you have to drive up there and it's an insane drive. It's to meet other Porsche people. Porsche people. Well, it, used to, it started as kind of Porsche people and now it's everybody. So you, it's every kind of car like like today there was everyone was crowding around it's funny that you say a Camry but there was like some old Camry like a first generation Camry but it was in mint condition everybody was crowded around that and I I, I said Camry kind of as, as a joke because that's just sort of a regular yeah it's a car, car. The most common but I also happen to love the 80s Camry oh man it's I, a I sick love car. the way it looks that yeah. boxy look you know that that kind of squarish look yeah i love that yeah yeah no i mean and you, people and the, someone had that yeah someone had one today <laughs> yeah it was like it was, a, it was a camry and then someone else had a there's like some sometimes like a pontiac aztec i don't know if you remember those absolutely that's the one that walter white drove yeah right yeah yeah so that's like so funny because i was looking that up yesterday i was like what was that as oh really called? the that, aztec i like cars that everyone else thinks is super ugly totally i like those you know yeah. like some of them I don't like. For example, the PT Cruiser. No, PT That's Cruiser never can never be, be cool. I don't think they can ever be. <laughs> they like, can never be cool. Maybe it'll be like ironically cool by like. Not even. In 20 years or something. I, I don't. I mean, it's a joke. The PT yeah. Cruiser is a joke. Like you drive a PT Cruiser, <laughs> you, hopefully you're renting it. Hopefully you don't own it. But 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 yeah, that's what I like it about up there because you'll see like 
Someone old, there are a lot of car review. All the car reviewers. The Paul, like, Thomas the Paul, Tom, Paul Thomas Cruiser. Paul Thomas Cruiser. Another actor with That's three really, goddamn names. That is so funny. Uh, Paul, <laughs> Paul Thomas Tom Anderson. Paul, Paul, Paul Thomas, Thomas Cruiser. Cruiser. <laughs> P.T. Cruz. Yo, P.T. Cruz, what's up? I uh, do all my own stunts. The parent-teacher uh, cruiser. Parent. That'd be cool if Tom Cruise named his son <laughs> P.T. Cruz. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God. P.T. Cruz. That is, oh, my God. That is hilarious. P.T. Cruz. All he needs to do is call him Paul Thomas. Paul Thomas, Paul Thomas Cruz. Cruz. Yeah, P.T. Cruz. P.T. Cruz. <laughs> so easy. Did you ever it's, see Leno up at right those there. meetups? Uh, he like hasn't he he hasn't been there when I've been there, but he was, I used to go down to, um, on Sundays, Sunday mornings, uh, it would be in uh, Santa Barbara. No, not Santa Barbara. Fucking, uh, what's the other? Malibu. There's a place called the Malibu Farmer's Market, and oh. everybody, there'd be a huge car meet up there, and it would always be Jay Leno, and uh, sometimes... Um, Seinfeld? Seinfeld would come. Really? Yeah. Seinfeld, Jay Leno, and... Uh, but, like, again, like, some of, like, the most popular car reviewer guys, like, on YouTube or whatever, like, from Road and Track or Motor... Uh, Motor, uh, motor trend, the whatever. All the car people would be there, um, and so yeah, sometimes he would be there. I don't think he comes up because it's it's a drive to get up there, like you. Yeah. But he loves driving, so I don't know. But yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I yeah, Leno. I got to go to his garage. He was inviting me to his garage with a friend of mine, and we we went and toured this whole thing and saw all the cars there. It's it's been really cool. Are you cool. into cars? You're into cars, I guess. I love cars. Yeah. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah, I do. I mean, I. Do you uh, have a lot of do cars? Do you have all your ultimate cars of your dreams? Yeah. Well, I have two of them. I have, I have the 992 Turbo S, and then I also have a Taycan Turbo S, which is a Porsche, electric Porsche. Um, Ooh, electric Porsche. Yeah, electric it's, Porsche. It's nasty. That's probably faster than the, any other Porsche. Those are fast, right? Well, they, they, it's funny. The, the, the Turbo S will do 0 to 60 in like 2.4 seconds, The but my car, the, the 911, does it in 2.2, but... Porsche intentionally does that because they always want their 911 Turbo S to be the fastest car. Oh, okay. So it has to be the fastest car, always. Uh, but, you know, it's a gas car versus an electric car. That's why I kind of wanted to have both of them. So I wanted to compare uh-huh. the, the two, like what the different driving dynamics. And um, and I drove electric for most of the time being in California. I had two Teslas. And, uh, yeah. And then I switched to the Porsche, and it drives just it drives like a Porsche. It's kind of crazy. It's the only electric car that has any soul to it. Huh. You know, like it still feels like a Porsche, whereas a Tesla feels like a really fast golf cart. Just like, just like, just like I'm steering. It's like, <laughs> how are you? Like when actors are doing a terrible job of driving when they're on a process trailer, right, like right. doing this. That's right, like what right, Teslas right. Are, just, or like when they're fake pian- playing the piano in oh the movies. Do you see that? Or they're like leaning in a lot. Or they're just. They're moving around way too much of their hands. Yeah, you know? totally. Just totally. Going yeah. like this, you know. Oh, it's the or worst. They're, or they're just moving their body a lot more than normally you would, and, and then they cut to the hands. They're playing that are guitar, actually... and they're just kind of like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're never. It's just one shape. Yeah, 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 shape, yeah, it's yeah, just yeah. Like always, yeah. just. It's like you hear the music going up where they should be yes, but higher up down. on there, but they're yeah, they're going the wrong way. They're going yeah. the wrong way. Yeah. All right, my favorite is those the empty coffee cups. I can't handle it. Oh, you I notice just want those? to strangle somebody when I see that. I'm like, just put some fucking water in there. Right. right. Also, take a bite. They're always like, you know, just yeah. like yeah, they're almost taking a bite. Yeah. You know, I don't know. I mean, you see that? Right. I well, mean, you, you got to imagine the actors can't just be eating well, 10 plates of pasta after 10 takes. They got it. spit. They have spit buckets. I hate that shit, man. I'm, I'm like, just fucking plan the shot so you can just do like two takes of it and they can yeah. actually eat. Right, you know what right, I mean? Right, like, right. I just like stop with this fucking around shit. Just like, oh, go ahead and uh, spit. T-. It was just, I'm not spitting out. It's so <laughs> gross. Like, I just, I'm going to eat it. I'm not spitting that shit out. It's fucking gross. Ugh. That's it. Also, I know this has been discussed before. Uh-oh. Why can't people say goodbye on the phone in a movie? Yeah, they just hang up, don't they? Yeah, every single time. Right. It's not, yeah. like, I think I saw it recently right. and I was like, I'm like, wow, I saw it. They said goodbye on the phone. Uh huh. Like just yeah, I mean, and also well, it's not going to make the movie right. ten it's minutes funny. longer. It's going to make it and the answer four too seconds quick. longer. The answer too quick. It's always like <laughs> go for Rodney. Like they're in the they're in the back hall. It's like and, the, and what would normally happen is like they're in the back hall. What hall? Yeah, they're in the back. They're in the back. Oh, can you hear me now? Yeah, yeah. they're in the back hall. Like yeah. that. Or be funny if they answer the phone. They said, "Hey," they say, "Hey, it's me." 
Is that who? Who? I sorry, I didn't. I don't know who. I didn't look at the caller ID. <laughs> oh, okay, yeah. So what's up? What are we doing? Oh, they're in the hall. Okay. Yeah. All right. I'll talk to you later. Bye. I would. Yeah, love they rather. They never say hello either. They're always like, yeah. <laughs> they, yeah. they say yeah. Yeah, totally. Have you ever said yeah to anyone that you're like, yes, not super pissed off at? Yes. What? Of course. <laughs> Wait, how hard is it to just be like, hello? Like. <laughs> Hey. Okay. So, uh, you guys, <laughs> why, is that, why is that so hard? Right. <laughs> like, no, because it's more dramatic. It'd be funny if it was an action movie, though, and they were saying, like, hi. Hey. So, um, listen, we got to get to the helicopter now, okay? Sorry, I'm right, getting I, the call. All right. Mom, I'll call you back. He's like, this. yeah? Hold on. Yeah, we got to get to the copter. <laughs> yeah, we got to get to the helicopter. Okay, I'll call you back. Hold on. Okay. Yeah, okay, so I'll meet you at the helicopter as soon as, as soon as possible. Okay, see you there in 10 minutes. Okay, all right, bye. Yeah, it's like, <laughs> they say bye really quick. It's in the, it's in the email. <laughs> yeah, I'll see you later. Hello? Oh, okay. I guess I hung up. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, they should always go to the other person. Hello? I guess he hung up. <laughs> oh, right. Some that's kind of funny. Asshole. Yeah, yeah. That's <laughs> right. Uh, they, yeah, that's the, only, the, that's the only way they could not say goodbye is right. if they just cut to the other call. You're going to, okay. You just, okay. All right, bye. Hello? Okay, bye, I guess. Bye, I guess. And you know what else I hate? It's like immediately when they get hung up, uh, 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 you hear that like oh, that, I know it's that hit, like 80s it like, happens when immediately the, when the thing is off the hook you know like uh, uh, oh uh, the biz, uh, do they do uh, that with uh, cell phones I swear I've heard that recently but it, it also that takes like another that takes like a while I know it's got to it doesn't kinda, immediately start right. going no uh, uh, uh. <laughs> no right no no it doesn't no it doesn't I, and also I've never it takes me out of the that. movie I've never experienced that. I've I've gotten it for sure the, like uh, the, uh, well, you, you've heard that noise. From oh no, no, not a cell phone. phone no, but a regular, a regular phone. phone. Yeah, 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 regular phones. You've yeah, heard regular it. phone. But yeah. it takes like what? Like probably like thirty seconds. It takes. Yeah, a while. it takes a little bit. It's yeah. like when it's well, way first off it's, the hook. First, it's got to go to a da da da. You know, your phone is right. you know blah blah blah, blah 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 something blah, blah, something blah, like that. Then it kind of goes silent for a little bit. Yeah. Then it kicks into the. You're oh fuck, and then you hang it up. I gotta find that sound. God damn it! That's fucked up. But um. Yeah, I, I just, have a yeah. oh, go ahead. no go no you go ahead. <laughs> no no I just like on that subject it's like I, I want I've been wanting to do just videos yeah <laughs> that's the sound that's it yeah <laughs> hang up the phone <laughs> hang it up is What's it that? hello are you there <laughs> oh, oh sorry I'm sorry no it's that. like this all right I'll talk to you later all right all right or it's like I'll talk all right man I'll talk to you later click it's yeah, just, it's, it's immediate. I've immediate, seen that yeah. before, yeah. yeah. It's too much. I'll meet you at the helicopter. I just want to do reenactment. <laughs> I want to do like A, B comparisons of like someone on an airplane or on a bus, right? And there's always that thing like in a movie or sitcom or whatever. There's like someone who needs help with their suitcase or whatever. Uh -huh. And they're like, oh, can I help you with that? And someone's like walking on and there's, there's nothing in the suitcases. And oh, you right. can it's tell. Just, they can pick it up so You can easily. tell there's nothing uh -huh. in the suitcases because yeah, no there's way no way to, to act. Like, uh -huh. just put some fucking weight in there. <laughs> like, yeah. I just want to do these, these A, B things like with people, you know, with like the cups or whatever to just be like, yeah. So same, you know, same lines and everything, same scene or whatever. And then yeah. now we're going to actually fill the, the cup <laughs> with water. <laughs> just, just be like, just like, oh, look at the difference, the physics. It's more believable. You know, it'd be a fun deep fake. You know, the, those deep fake videos is just add somebody saying goodbye. Like, Make them all say goodbye oh, yeah, real yeah. quick. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Helicopter at five. Oh, goodbye. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Just throw it in real quick. It's like, great. Okay, so I'll talk to you later. Yeah. <laughs> I mean... They just make their lips do it. Well, it's like well, the, the, the calculator. They're like, well, that adds a. Two, if we do that for every scene where someone's hanging up, that adds approximately 10 seconds more to the film. So let's just cut those <laughs> those parts. Nah. No. I have this no. idea. Oh, shit. Uh -oh, for Reggie, yeah. but I, I don't oh, want to okay, put you on me. the spot. Oh, shit. So just feel free to just give me a signal. Just wink. Wink at me with your right eye that if you don't want... Okay. <laughs> if, that, if, you, if this is just maybe something we... I don't know. It's just... I, okay. Because speaking of okay. real, realism or yeah. whatever... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Reggie's really good at accents and, uh -huh. you know, just really having really... Uh, you guys do accent for accent. I'm not no Reggie is really good at just nuance and really ha having a, kind of bring in an authenticity to the voices he does. And I thought it would be kind of a fun thing cuz I feel like you can do a lot of different countries accents mm -hmm. and or in different regions of the United States or other countries mm -hmm. too. 
And I thought it'd be kind of fun to just throw different things at you and, you know, I don't know. Is oh, that yeah. too much pressure? Or no, no. I, does that sound like a fun no, idea? No, it sounds is fun. That, it sounds maybe fun. he needs to have a sentence that he needs can respond with. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I mean, okay, you know, like, so how about... Mom, you, you, these how about, about I'll see you at the helicopter. Uh, I'll see you at the helicopter, you know, at 9, uh, 10, 9 p.m. or something like that. Uh, or... D- what? These nuts are your mom now. Oh yeah, these nuts. Yeah, these nuts are your. Well, these nuts are your mom now. Might be because D's is a weird. Well, then again, you could try doing D's in different country voices. Okay, these nuts are your mom now. I these guess. Nuts are your mom. Okay, that might be a little hard. Okay, then maybe that's too hard. So maybe. Or maybe well, whatever. I'll just, just, I'll just doesn't freestyle. matter. Freestyle. I'll freestyle. Actually, freestyle. you know what? Freestyle. I think freestyle. The freest what, of styles. Because sometimes the accent so will. Ins- I think for I think you the, especially yeah, inspires. The sentence is it, there. Insp- in the it, it inspires you to talk about something that you feel is associated with the accent. So I feel you like. ask yeah. him a question, then he'll respond to the question. Well, I kind of just want to throw some countries at him or different. Oh, okay, sure. I mean, actually, before we get into that, yeah, yeah, yeah. how did you, did you, I mean, you definitely have a knack for voices and how, how did that happen? I mean, is it, I know your mom's French. You're and like born I, in Germany. I was born in Germany and then, yeah. We, we, <laughs> Germany. We, 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 I mean, you obviously had a French influence, so you had the French accent down probably since you were a little I kid, I mean, right? I kind of have a, it's a more of a standard French accent. I can't, my, my mother's French accent was insane. I mean, like. That's what I'm saying. I is can't it probably, really do that one. But you probably got, that. was that your first accent that you were doing? Was that, or was it, what uh, was your first accent? God. Hyundai. I have no idea. Hyundai. Um, no, the no. Hyundai accent. Oh, Hyundai accent. No, Hy- no. I, I don't know. It probably would have been. Well, I spoke Spanish when I was younger. I don't anymore. But uh, I don't know. It would have been that, or would have just been silly voices, or like maybe an English accent. Where, when did you start doing voices? Did you do voices when you were a ki- little kid? I mean, I, I guess I, all kids are doing voices, but I think uh, it's mimicry. It's like yeah. whatever you found funny. You know, like yeah, if I found something funny, I would be like, oh yeah, like blah 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 blah. You know, like yeah. you just kind of immediately try to reflect it. Yeah, you're really good funny. at mimicking. Yeah. Uh, well, it. not just mimicking, actually, but also creating new things within that thing, you know, or something. Yeah. So, I don't know. You want to start with, uh, well, start with a French accent. What's your French accent like? Uh, the French accent is like, <laughs> well, it is a little, little bit like this, uh, you know, it, it depends <laughs> on uh, if you are, you know, having a good time or not. Uh, <laughs> It's uh, hard to say, but um, you know, uh, all the time we uh, we try to uh, have a good time. <laughs> you know what it's like? It's like these. There's it's impressions, but they're not of anything. They're no. not of people, but specifically people. But they're just these broader kind of impressions that are. But they're really specific too, though. It's so good. I yeah. love it. Well, it's like this. If you can do the subtlety, it's really nice yeah. because it, then it's just like because oftentimes when people do accents, they'll go really big. Yeah. And so obviously sometimes it's funny to just go big like yeah. that. But like if I'm trying to do like uh, get into an accent, it's nice if you can hit it in a subtle way. Would you be able to do an? I mean, would you know how to do an Algerian accent? Hell no. Because <laughs> well, there's I, French I, influence there. I heard you know, him I say think, right? something in. I heard him do a Russian earlier. Oh, now, yeah. how do they have? How do people have fun in Russia? Yeah, can Russia, you do the difference? Well, between Russian Ukraine? is hard to do because it's, um, <laughs> uh, it's weird. It's like it's almost like tuning a like a frequent like tuning in a radio dial. Like sometimes <laughs> I can feel it. Like when I was hanging out with my friend Milana, um, she, uh, she's well, she speaks Russian, and her father is Russian, and so being around Vitra? her, yeah, 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 mm-hmm. um, and I was like. So I was doing the, uh, so I, we were kind of joking around, Spasiba, how are you doing it or whatever, it was doing this stuff, and it came really easily, but then sometimes uh, if I'm if I'm like, oh, I'm going to do a Russian accent, it does, it, sure. it, it's like this general kind of Eastern European, but it's not necessarily Russian, it's just kind of like some, like an Eastern European, like someone from Latvia who moved to Russia, uh-huh. you know what I mean, <laughs> yeah, 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 who yeah, now yeah. lives in Croatia. How did you do, you can do a lot of different... English accents. Where did you get it, that from? Well, that's just from watching TV. Yeah, all right. Yeah, right. yeah, yeah. That, I mean, t- shit. I mean, I. Can you do different regions of England? I kind of. I mean, if someone's like, do a northern accent, I can't really do that. But that's what I'm wondering. Can you do a Manchester versus, a, say, a London? Not, not really. I mean, like, I can do like, you know, if I'm speaking like this, <laughs> I can, I can, I can talk like this, but I don't know if, where it's from exactly. You know, <laughs> it's like it's an area. It's maybe someone who's moved to London and they live there, but I'm not, no, they might be from like. Like Bletchford or something, <laughs> you know, and they might be somewhere else like Croydon or whatever. But like, um, yeah, it's and of course you got like, like 
someone who speaks in the back of the throat. Yeah, yeah, no, yeah. the way they're always talking about that. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, it's like, what are you doing here? What's going on there? What are you doing? What you mean? What are you doing here? Why are you doing that? <laughs> <laughs> why, why are you all doing that? Why? Come here. What about know. a Scottish accent? Can you do Scottish? Not, no. I mean, not really. It's or like, Irish? It's like a Sc- Scottish. It's like I can do like a, a Glaswegian accent, but not saying words. So it's like, oh yeah, shit, I need to go down there, you know what, right? <laughs> Everyone there, you get to show them that you shave Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> you don't even, yeah. I, I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> and, I, and Irish is hard. <laughs> it's like, it, uh, yeah, there, it's there are times when I can do an Irish accent, <laughs> but, it, but it's, it's, it's a bit shit. Um, yeah. That's good. But English is weird. It's like, if I hear it, if it, I hear it, I can kind of hold on. I'm like um, Rogue. Is there a, you know, is the, there a, a Welsh accent? There is a Welsh accent. What does that sound? Well, it's like? Anthony Hopkins. If you ever oh. hear him in interviews, oh, he's Welsh. He's Welsh, yeah. Okay. Or um, I can't know what Catherine Zeta Jones is too, right? Yeah, but and I don't. Christian Bale. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay, it's it's it is like once you hear it, you'll you'll you you zero into it. It's kind of like okay, Welsh is kind of like New Zealand to you know like. Can, Australia, New Zealand. Can you do a Philadelphia versus a New York kind of oh, accent? Oh, Jesus. <laughs> I have no idea. No, I mean, New York is easy, you know. <laughs> you talk like this, you know. You, 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 you're going down, you're like walking, you're going down like Midtown, whatever. And you and you, and you stop and then you're seeing this guy and you're like, why are you doing this? You, you fucking, you're fucking driving me insane. Why are you doing this? <laughs> I'm looking at you and you're just looking at me and I'm like, what are we doing here? You're going to move? I'm going to move? Who's going to move? I'm walking. Whatever. Like, <laughs> <laughs> There's like kind of an attitude that you can yeah. really grab onto yeah, yeah, yeah. with New York. Philadelphia's tough. I'd have to really hang and I'd have to, really, you know. It's like I, no, I, it's like Philly. It's more like um, Wada and yeah. Philly Boy Roy. You know Philly Boy Roy? No, who's Philly Boy Roy? I think there's a character from the Sharplings. Yeah, show. yeah, that's right. Where, I can't do it. Where's but Bill from? I kind of, at one point, if I hear it for a while, I can do it. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. You know that's what I mean? Like, yeah, if, yeah, you, it's if like, you're around it. It's like you can just mimic it once you're hearing it, but yeah. is there a such thing as a New Jersey accent? What's that sound? There like? is a New Jersey accent, but I don't. I fucking don't know. Well, uh, it's like the fucking Sopranos. <laughs> yeah, it's like kind of like maybe like this. Yeah, maybe I don't know. Yeah, it's coming. <laughs> New York is kind of like this, and New Jersey is kind of like this. Yeah, maybe it's like that. Yeah, yeah. maybe it's yeah. like that. Maybe it's a little something like that. I don't know. And then of course there's people that talk like this, and I I don't know where they're from, but I I enjoy. <laughs> Talking like now, that. that's the best accent right there. No, where so would you would you imagine that's from? Y'all ever? I don't know. I think it's from like maybe Oklahoma or something like that. <laughs> you know, somewhere around there. You know, there's like people who talk like, <laughs> like <laughs> North. One time I was on I was on tour with. Um, Roy Scoville. Roy, Roy Scoville, and the whole time we we're just going, we we're just like, so where are you going? I don't know. Y'all know, y'all know. <laughs> we're going. To, <laughs> we're y'all gonna do some comedy night? <laughs> it was just the whole time we were just going back and forth, and it was awesome. Kind of like Alabama. You were just yeah. Doing that thing. I mean, it's yeah. Actually, it dances around. You know what Fred Armisen says is people from Portland have no accent. That's like the. This. Well, it's, Northwest, right? It's a flat. No, the, the it's most, flat. The most North, non-accent. Northwest is zone. the most standard kind of voice. Yeah, it's, no, it's no, yeah, no accent. Although Montana, well, I was going to ask Montana's you because you're from Montana. Flat. There is no Montana accent. Right. I've tried it, but I, I don't. I don't think it, there's colloquialisms. They don't, don't get a little southern up there. No, oh. people think they do, but it's not. Oh. It's Montana. It's like it's right. just a western. State. Is there a California accent? Can you do it? Yeah, there's like California. You know, like <laughs> you're from California. It's like, hey, what's going on? Yeah, so um, you want to go to Montecito? I was going to go there the other day. Anything that has an O at the end of it, like burrito or whatever, like it's kind of like a way to talk, you know? It's kind of like real fast like that, kind of, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, for sure. Yeah. Oh, right. I don't know. Yeah, it's like a little spicoli kind Yeah, it's a little bit. It's like a little bit like that. Like you're stoked. Like you're stoked. You guys like, what are you guys doing? You guys going tonight? You guys, where are you guys going? You guys gonna get some donuts? You're like, right. oh, <laughs> some donuts. Yeah. All right. Oh. You guys just get some avocados. <laughs> <laughs> We're thinking about Let's picking to, up some avocados. Yeah, avocados can go to La, La Cienega. <laughs> <laughs> My friend Jorge on La Cienega is gonna be, is gonna be a sir. It's gonna be so rad. Um, <laughs> yeah. And then, and then there's like pan, like, you know, like kind of 
Uh, I don't know a kind of accent like this. I don't know where it's from, but it could be um, could, could be Cuba, could, could be, be yeah. could be uh, could be Venezuela. You know, you don't know. It's because so everyone they have different <laughs> way of coming at things. You know, <laughs> so you don't know your region they're from. You know, if your family is from somewhere else, but second generation, <laughs> you don't know. Chile. <laughs> Chile, Brazil, 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 Yeah, yeah. But I don't, you know, do yeah. the accent though. That's just saying the words. But well, when sometimes when I'm singing fake languages, oh yeah, lo, some people will think I'm speaking uh, Portuguese. Portuguese, Portuguese, or Portuguese, Portuguese. like Brazilian <laughs> Portuguese. So you yeah. you you sing in fake languages a lot, yeah, a lot. Do you, can you it's sing a, a, sing in when a you fake do it, When you do your live act a lot of times, you just, yeah. you don't have a set list. You just no. go in and you just like build, build it right there right yeah. in front of everybody. Yeah. There's yeah. no set list at all. There's no thought in your head of, there's no, I'm going to do. nothing in the back pocket, no yeah. jams you got ready I'm going to gonna go. do a New York voice or something, or I'm going to no. do an English character here or something. N not really. Sometimes I'll, I'll, like when I'm like a lineup, you know, night. With a bunch of people on it, I usually watch everybody. So if I'm if I'm like you know later on in the show, I'll watch everybody. I'll get there and watch everybody just because I also like to just watch the show. But yeah. I'll get a flavor for what's already happened, what people uh -huh. talked about, and stuff like that. And so I might like go, well, that person. <laughs> some people, t you know, they're like talking like this, whatever. They're from, you know, this like this New Yorkers up there. And then I'll come up and I'll be like, I'm like hello, how are you? You know, I'll, I'll do something that's different because I want it to impact in a different way. Yeah, right? like, yeah, well, yeah. this has happened. Let's you try this. Hit heart, hit. Yeah. 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 I'll give them something different that they haven't had. So I'll, I'll have, there's a starting, like I'll start with this, maybe a, an idea of how I'm going to start. But sometimes I just rock up and hope something good happens. And then when you do stand up where you don't do any musical stuff at all. Yeah. That's just off the top of the head too. Yeah. 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 For sure. Yeah. Way easier. Is that I love seeing easier. that. I actually yeah. love seeing that. Way was, easier. But yeah, because yeah. you don't have because to, to rehearse, you know, and don't have to write stuff. <laughs> also, I mean, easier than doing the music part. Like than, they're, than they're doing... equally e easy. Really, music's a little easier. That's just crazy you that you think that's easy. <laughs> 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 I have to like be so like scripted. <laughs> also, Reggie's really good at oh creating God. music without even using any uh, machinery or instruments. Yeah, yeah, just yeah. with singing, he I, he's good at creating a, a sense of the whole music sure, we should piece do something right now well oh, yeah. I, don't, I don't know we're putting yeah. on the spot right, like that box. nah nah but <laughs> um but i i wait by, by the way do you do impressions of um <laughs> i know you do a really good cosby but do you do uh, but do you do any other specific people <laughs> really great cosby you do uh, you do cosby, really you good do cosby Epstein, you do I do Epstein. <laughs> yeah i do Epstein. you do weinstein you do i do, I you do a really good weinstein Epstein, really good cosby. i do the steens <laughs> yeah um but, um, but your, Cosby, your well. Cosby was really good. Well, I mean, I haven't heard it in a long well, time. Well, it's it's yeah. okay. I haven't done it in a long time. I mean, but really, when I'm doing Bill Cosby, I'm doing Eddie Murphy's Bill Cosby. Oh, is that right? Because I got it from Raw. Yeah. You know? yeah, 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 yeah. The way that he you know he's talking. Right, I can't even <laughs> do it right now. I'm no, doing, no, that's I'm good. It's good. He's like, no. Yeah. <laughs> you put the, the Jello in the pudding, pudding, put that pudding pop there. <laughs> which is Phil Flan, Phil Flan, Phil. You know when Camille used to. Say to me, yeah, whatever that and you talked about the cookies. I remember you cookies. Do the <laughs> put the cookie in, in cookie. the milk. You take the milk, the there's yeah. no hard uh, consonants. It's a, it's a cookie, cookie. <laughs> cookie. <laughs> take the cookie and put the cookie in the milk. No, <laughs> oh, you just put the milk in the cookie in the jello, the jello the pudding pops. <laughs> <laughs> Picture pages. Um, <laughs> so dumb. Can you do Eddie Murphy? I can't do Eddie Murphy. Eddie Murphy is a little. Uh, is a little. Uh, 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 oh look, it's Taz S. Fustock. <laughs> <laughs> Who's that? I don't know. Answer. Let's find out. Let's go live. Speakerphone, please. Okay. Taz S. Fustock. You, you're you're on live. I'm on live. <laughs> you're on live at ATC All Things Comedy Podcast. <laughs> the Poundcast. Poundcast. Oh. Sorry. <laughs> well, I'm just calling in to find out. You know, should I um, should I have a sex change? Sex change. Just leave it up to the audience. <laughs> Do it. Chop it off. 
Oh, ah, oh, Keep the bell end. Keep, I mean, keep it. On you, but. He can't go back once you go off. Once you once you go off, you can't go back. <laughs> That's the rule. Once you go off, you can't go on. Yeah, once you once you yeah once you go off, you can't go on. <laughs> you can go in, but you can't go on. <laughs> yeah, that's all right. Uh, um, are you in LA? I am. Yeah, I'm just saying it. <laughs> doing the doing the pound cast at, at allthingscomedy.com. Uh, it's it looks really good. We're all hanging out here. We've got one. One person holding a handheld microphone while everyone else has professional microphones. I don't know what that's about. Well, I kind of know. But anyways, what are you doing? You can take a piece of fruit and it will just, it'll be, I think, sound just right. I don't even know what that is. <laughs> that's... That, um, what do you okay. mean? Oh. Well, uh, anything special you're calling about? Maybe. What? Yes, I want to see you. <laughs> oh, right. Well, uh, I you, let me... I had a, an idea and I wanted to talk to you. Oh, fucking hell. All right. So um, I will um, let me call you back because, um, you know, maybe that idea is very illegal and, and it'll be recorded on this <laughs> podcast. And you don't want that. You don't want that. Trust me, I've, I've been through it all. So um, I'll give you a call back. I'll be done with this podcast in about three hours. In, in, enjoy your casting of the pods. Thank you. I love I love taking a handful of pods and just throwing them into the air. <laughs> <laughs> all right, I'll, I'll call you in a bit. All right, that's enough. Uh, all right. Okay, cheers, mate. Cheers. Rabbits. See, he hung up like a movie. That's wild. Uh, he did that. He didn't say goodbye. He goes, that's enough. And then it was like, dun, dun, dun. But I don't know who Taz. You don't know who that is? Uh, no. Wait, go to text him and see if you could. There's an old text thread. Oh, you know? yeah, yeah, like, yeah, see yeah, if you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Taz. Oh, shit. No, 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 no. Who is Taz? I don't well, know. From don't Looney Tunes. Don't want to blow him up. Maybe, from Looney Tunes. You know, maybe he's. Wait, who's uh, the info? Like, oh, okay, there we go. Oh, oh, wait a minute. I see. Hello, my friend. Interesting stuff to talk about. See, he seems to want to talk about interesting things. He might so turn my left leg into a wheelbarrow full of donuts, <laughs> and a right eye uh, into a disco ball. That's so he has this cross, this fascination with like turning himself into things. That's interesting that you don't know who that is. But you, do you know and who you he don't is? even based on. Look, the, there's a conversation there. Can you gather anything um, from what you've said? Oh, wait a minute. Maybe you met him at a show one night. And do you something? do you talk to a lot of people you don't know? Kind of, or do people contact you randomly? He seems like to a pretty accessible. Like, no, what I mean is, is know. do people yeah. randomly call you, get your number somehow, and you don't know who they are? Uh, no, that that doesn't happen so much. Like I've usually given it to them. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, this is, I don't know. I'm trying to see if I can find, because it. it Want to Google? It, it's a we I'm going to Google. Okay, so that yep, yeah, there's pictures of him. He seems to be a, uh, he seems to be out a lot with uh, women with different lengths of hair, <laughs> uh, which is rare. Uh, and and uh, I guess let's see, introducing the soft power of thirty, the bohemian genius behind Notting Hill Hotspot Lalo. Oh shit! Yes, I remember. <laughs> what is this? Is he own, owner of a club or something? Hit you back. Um, <laughs> You're like, okay, I get it. Uh, he, he, so he owns, there's this place in London oh. called Lalo, which is, I guess it's a, it's a members club. It's like a Soho house, but it's not, yeah. but it's like a smaller Soho house. And it has like this really cool, it's beautiful inside, like a Soho house. Uh, it has a kind of like a, like a Hollywood, like 1940s stylized, whatever, sure. inside. It's really beautiful. But they have like the best burger in all. In that I've ever had on Earth, really? Yes, on Earth. What's so in good about it? Huh? What's so good about it? They they uh, they use like three different types of meat, and then they they, uh, I think they, I think they they grill it a little bit, and then they steam it, mm. and it keeps it super super juicy, and then it's not it's not big, which is my favorite thing. I don't like when a burger is like a big fat whatever like oh look at all this sloppy gr gross shit falling right. out of it it's like a small burger yeah. that you can just enjoy and uh. you don't have to worry about it getting all over you right and um if it doesn't get it if it gets all over the place then you don't want it in your face i don't yes exactly <laughs> all over the place not in my face yeah <laughs> yeah here's my impression of that guy real quick brent i'm the guy calling you you answer the phone okay just act like okay. mime like you're okay. picking up the phone okay ring ring it Ring, ring, ring. <laughs> oh. 
<laughs> like he just that's started. He started right. laughing he before was. anything was said. Well, you were talking about like, Spicoli, just, and just he, asked, you summoned he just, him. You answered. And he's like, no, wait, comes right. in laughing. He started laughing already. He was like laughing before you even said hi. Yeah. Right. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so you know, we figured out who the guy is. He makes the best burger on earth. You got to get back to London, dude. All right, let's see if we can get all of us in here. It's proof of life. <laughs> you know what? That is kind of the end of the show. Yeah. Um, did you tell him about the unzipped? I no. I kind of. Well, I don't we'll, know what we'll, kind of time. We're he gonna has wrap unzipped. up the main no. episode here. We'll talk to you about unzipped. Okay. It's an optional um, nice. hangout. Uh, okay. You can, you can stick around a little longer if you wish. <laughs> okay. If you but wish. if not, if you gotta um, go, is, we really yeah, appreciate you. Yeah. Coming thanks on for the coming show. coming down. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. 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 That flew great. by because that was yeah. that's fun as hell talking to you. It's fun as hell, yeah. It was well, it was super, well good. Super dope. That well was good. well, it was well, well good. good. That was fucking that was well good. Absolutely bro. well good, mate. That's well good, mate. And if you want to keep listening, you just go to patreon.com slash poundcast. And me and Brent are going to keep talking. Maybe Reggie will hang out. Maybe he's going to head to London. We don't know. Maybe he's going to head to to. But that's the to only way to Taz's listen to place. the bonus material, the bonus unzipped poundcast special chunk of the show. And um, thank you to Aaron Bruntgart behind the he's boards. behind the boards. And thank oh. you to uh, Jack Birch, who's also kind of behind the boards He's in a different sense. Board. He's in London, isn't he? Fucking in, London. Isn't he? He is in London. And, Welcome. And Jackie Montana. Jackie Montana. And also Daniel Avila. And check out Louisville Vegan Fur Foods at lvjco.com. Use the code word <laughs> Poundcast30 for 30% off. How about Louisville Vegan Fruits? It stands for Lesbian oh, Brigade. That's an idea. Louisville Vegan no, that's Fruits. that's wild. <laughs> vegan Fruits. That's, wild. that's something new. All right. Thanks, Reggie. You're welcome. Bye, everybody. Chupacabra. Chupacabra. Doug and Brent talking to each other. Doug and Brent, what will they talk about today? Doug and Brent are talking to some pimples. Doug and Brent will talk to their 